If your gallbladder has cancer, gallstones, is inflamed or diseased, you may need gallbladder surgery known as a cholecystectomy. The gallbladder is a little organ that aids in digestion and is located beneath the liver. It is not a necessary organ, but it does hold bile, a fluid produced by the liver that aids in the breakdown of lipids. Your gallbladder is not necessary for survival. To break down fats, the liver still produces bile. There are a few different techniques for performing gallbladder surgery, and the one you choose will depend on the type of repair you require. Before the procedure, you might undergo a physical examination, blood testing, or other types of examinations prior to surgery. The surgery will be described by your surgeon, who will also go over any risks or potential issues with you. You should raise any questions you have regarding the process at this point. Your physician will need your signature on a consent document before they may perform the surgery. Read the forum carefully, and if required, ask clarifying questions. Before the procedure, you will be instructed to fast for at least 8 hours. Tell your healthcare practitioner if you're a woman and if you're pregnant or think you could be pregnant. If you have any allergies, let your doctor know about all of the medications and supplements you use. Also, ask your doctor in advance if there are any drugs you should cease taking before surgery. What happens during surgery? When you're ready for surgery, you'll be given general anesthesia to put you into an unconscious state. The surgeon makes several small cuts or incisions in your belly for laparoscopic surgery. A small amount of carbon dioxide gas may be used to inflate your belly. A thin tube with a camera and light called a laparoscope is put through one incision, and the surgeon can clearly see your organs with the scope. Surgery tools are put through the other incisions. The gallbladder is taken out through one of the incisions. The scope and other instruments are then removed. If you have open surgery, a 2-3 inch incision is made in the upper right side of your belly. The surgeon will gently push aside your abdominal muscles and liver and take out the gallbladder through this incision. During surgery, your surgeon may use an x-ray to look at the bile ducts inside your liver. A special contrast dye is injected into your bile system and an x-ray is taken. This will show any gallstones that may still be in the bile duct. If any stones are found, the surgeon will take them out. The incision is then closed with stitches or surgical glue. After the procedure, your gallbladder will be sent to the lab for analysis following the procedure. You'll be sent to a recovery room, where you'll be given painkillers. You might leave later that day or the following morning. You might need to spend more time in the hospital if there are any difficulties. A prescription for painkillers will be supplied to you when you are given permission to return home. Additionally, an antibiotic prescription can be issued to you. Make sure you adhere to all the instructions once you get home. Get lots of sleep. The first few days, clutch to your tummy when you laugh or cough. This can lessen any pain you may experience following surgery. You can go back to work, shower, and do other normal activities when your doctor says it's okay. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and support us to learn more. Thank you.